Well, happening today, a big day here in the Treasure Valley. The first daughter and Apple's CEO will both be in Idaho. Ivanka Trump and Tim Cook are scheduled to visit the Wilder School District today. CBS 2's Lauren Clark is live out in Wilder for us this morning to tell us more about the purpose of this high profile visit. Hey, good morning, Denny and Brian. Certainly a very big day for the Wilder School District. Now, the White House just confirming that Ivanka Trump, that's the White House advisor and first daughter, along with Apple CEO Tim Cook, will be in just a few hours walking through these doors and meeting with Wilder students. Now, we're being told that the reason of this visit is to see how technology affects their learning in the classroom. Uh, now, this video we have up right here uh, gives you an idea of when we actually were here at the Wilder School District, what students get to do on a day to day basis. Wilder School District is named as the one of the 25 most innovative schools in America right now, and they're known for their mastery based education. So what this is, is that students get to learn on their own pace. They usually use an iPad and they get to learn subjects uh, as their pace determines it. So whether they're a little bit slower or faster and they get to move along that with the gate, the aid of a teacher. They also have a 3D printer there at the school as well as they get to learn how to do animations for movies, so very exciting. In fact, in 2016, Wilder School District actor received a grant on this, so they got to use some of that money and funnel it into these types of innovative projects. Now, we'll be covering this throughout the entire day here on CBS 2 News, and school is going to start in just a few hours. I'll be sure to give you the most up-to-date information. I'll also be tweeting out what I'm seeing during real time. If you want to see that, follow me. My Twitter is Lauren KVOI. Reporting live here in Wilder, Lauren Clark, CBS 2 News. Well, as Lauren mentioned, our crews are going to be out there all day this morning into the afternoon covering this visit. We're hearing that it's a closed event, uh, but again, we'll be bringing you updates on air and online as well. Check out our KBY2 Facebook page and IdahoNews.com for more.